This episode of Make It Happen is brought to you by Cardinal Financial, where we do home loans and we're good at it. We're here at the Norman, what is it called? We are at, we are at the Oklahoma, we are at the Oklahoma City Convention Center. And we're having, I'm, me and Chef, my brother, are having a tournament here, an indoor soccer tournament. Going to eat Bart. What do you think it has? Burgers. Burgers. Yeah, same. It smells like burgers. Nah. Okay, we're gonna go eat some burgers at Spark while well, we are in between uh, the futsal games. So we just ended Shep's game and he won. It was like eight to one. So this is fantastic. So you rated it, and you rated it a four and a half stars out of five stars. Excellent. All right. So you have had how many games? Three so far. How many have you won? One. Oh. I've won. I had three, lost two, and won one. And no matter what, I'm getting a silver or gold medal. Excellent. We'll make sure we get that. Let's go see this beautiful Christmas tree. Three, two, one. Scissor Till Park is a 70-acre public space that opened up on September 27, 2019. Scissor Till Park Foundation is a nonprofit organization that is responsible for raising funds to support the park through donations, sponsorships, and earned revenues. There's a 3.7-acre lake, playground, interactive water fountains, seasonal roller rink, dog park, sports courts, picnic grove, restaurants, and a performance stage. There's lots of amenities for all to enjoy in downtown OKC. All right, our 2015-2016 co-ed bronze division first place winners in First of all, I was laughing because I saw you, so I was like, I'm, I'm going to honk. I'm glad you did. I'm going to honk. Hi. Uh, that's so funny because I was just picked up an investor for that house. Oh, good. Yeah, like a big time investor. What is it? <laughs> did you take them to a restaurant? It's Panera. <laughs> I have to take it back. You look cute. Oh, do I? No way. Yeah. You Gross. tan I smell like a, and well, you got I, your... Yeah, spray tan. You're dark and you got your <gasps> dark eyebrow. Oh, sorry, yeah. No, you're okay. It does a good job. I kind of like it. We're working. off on an adventure. <laughs> Stay tuned. Please, all the prayers. 
I don't. I think I have a taser with me. Oh, I don't know if I have my taser. Yeah, this is embarrassing. I've got to go. I think it's amazing, and it probably happens a lot more than what you think. Mm-hmm. I wonder if they have like a GPS on it. Oh. I got a Zillow under contract. I need to put that on there before the month's over. I think we are gonna hit quota. Yay! I'm sorry. Heading out to this Northridge house. We're heading out to um, Saw. <laughs> We're heading out. Like, Saw 3. The windows. Saw 4. Okay. Because I feel like every client I've had gets their license. Like nine times out of ten. It's funny. Yeah, because you're not wrong. And I'm like, and then they never come to me. Like I can count five to ten People. clients that have their license, but they're at like... It's funny, I came to you and when I first wanted to get my license, you were like, meh. I was a, I'm a very Debbie but Downer. Yeah, but it's not, I mean, you weren't wrong. I was like, listen, I'm going to be very transparent. People are not going to be honest. They want a warm body. It's really hard. It takes a lot of effort. You weren't wrong. And Look at this. Look at the neighbor. Yeah. The backyard's you know the worst. He's, I, it's been worse. So this, they own that too. So that driveway, that driveway that is goes back to their, yeah, I think okay, like cool. that's like on the other side well, is a little I think bit of a property he line. uses the driveway. Oh, for sure. That dude. Doing realtor things. <laughs> doing it. We're doing it. All right. We had to walk back here. Do you want to show them the front? Yep. 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 Investor special. Let's go around this way. Investor special. Oh boy. The investor that called me earlier was like, so you think it needs a new HVAC? And I go, well, let's just assume that it needs all brand new systems. It just needs. The roof actually doesn't look that bad. Everything. Oh, it just makes me so sad because when I sold them this house. It was so cute. Adorable. Oh, see. But look at the large lot, but yes, look at that. Okay, here we go. So we need to put <sighs> my extra jacket. Oh, wow. Hello. Hello. Okay, so nothing's on. These are lovely. This is a nice addition to the home to catch your bugs. Slide drafts. What are those? Oh. The window. That says leave and poop. Does it really? Yeah. How does this happen? How does this, how does, is, were they burning a chair? They did, they burnt a chair. Oh my Probably God, they did. One. Wow. Are you doing anything with that not too bad. I just want to make sure that there's no drugs that were made in here. Mr. We were no. All appliances are gone. I mean, it could be worse, I guess. Don't worry, I have my knives and my pistol. Okay. <gasps> I don't even want to walk on it. Oh, no. Like, my thing is, is... Why is there head country and just jelly on the floor? Or, oh, it always scares me when I find a spoon. Look, right there. This is the things they don't tell you about real estate, friends. Mm. Like, what is all this? It's pretty bad. Are those all pills? Pills. Oh my gosh, there was drugs involved in this house. Oh, well last time I was here, which was almost a year ago, there were needles everywhere. My okay. shoes are not going back in my closet tonight. <laughs> oh my gosh, what is this? We're okay. okay. It's not that bad, I guess. I mean, it's good. at least like, you can tell it's got good bones. Like it just really needs to be picked up. <laughs> Oh, oh, this shower. is a creepy room. Okay. Okay. Nothing to see here. No, it's really not too bad in here. It's not like crazy. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. We want to fight. 
Okay, so they've turned off everything, so that's good. Okay. Like the banks. Uh, what? Just stinks. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, I gotta find the water heater and. Okay, water heater's in the garage. Kay. Now here's the thing: this Kay. the garage is separate from this the house. house. Okay. So you want to be down in here, and we'll go. Yeah, let's let's do a quick or, video. Real yeah, fast. do your okay social media video. Well, we are at our next listing that you are gonna have the pleasure of selling. <laughs> and um, okay, let's do a quick walkthrough. Oof. It's unfortunately I sold this place when it was rehabbed and beautiful, and then it all. Okay, that might be poop. <laughs> Update the kitchen. Oh my gosh. I gotta get some fresh air. I got a spray tan today and it's, I'm gonna look like a spotted in Loompa. <laughs> oh my god, this is getting wet. I gotta get it out of the rain. Okay. Oh! Be careful for the glass. Yeah. Go home, do not enter. And poo! <laughs> you know, honestly, I think the seller wrote that because of the squatters. Like okay. She was like trying to scare them. Oh, good, 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 good. Okay, so I think water heater straight ahead. Okay. We turn on some lights. And lights we don't have. Just, this is the nicest room in the house. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'm dead serious. This is the nicest room in the house. There's yeah. the electrical. I kind of wanted to see that. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Of course. Okay. What are we That's looking for? That's not a bad panel. Is okay. it a Federal Pacific? It's not a Federal Pacific. Okay. Not going into the attic? No. No, 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 no. We will not be going in the attic. And then water heater. Heaters. I'm assuming that's the, the water heater is not bad. I would like to see the HVAC. HVAC? Oh, there it is. That is it. I looked at earlier. HVAC was, um, it, it, I mean, everything just needs to be updated. Yeah. There's no, there's nothing in here that I think anyone can save. It doesn't look that bad, but oh God. Oh God, there's no water heater. <laughs> <laughs> okay. They stole it. Okay. Yep. Water heater gone. Somebody was stole. It was stole. But I mean, there's a nice connection, but yeah, that, oh, somebody stole geez. it. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> yeah, I gotta like brush my teeth. Yeah, okay. Okay, good. What time is it? 4.30? Perfect. Right? Yeah, yeah, perfect timing. Where are you going again? Edmond. Oh, you really gotta go. What are you doing? Showing a house at six. <sighs> Sorry. Oh no, you're fine. That'll be, I have plenty of time. I need to figure out where it's I just love how busy you are. Yeah, no, it's great. I love it too. Making that money. Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be about an hour drive. So, probably good timing. Oh, wow. Yeah. Wow. Wow. That ain't good. I know, but that's okay. I'm Bree Butler. Welcome to my open house. This home is new construction by Liberty Homes. Three bedroom, two bathroom. It's gorgeous. Come check it out. Okay, have you had anybody come in through the open house yet? Yes, we actually had someone walk in right at two o'clock today whenever we started and um, their agent had the flu, so they just came and helped oh, themselves. Oh shoot. And, yeah, I looked around and I was like, oh gosh. So, what do you know about this house? It is three bedroom, two bathroom, um, 18,000 square feet. I believe it's 1855. Nice. And it was built this year, so you know, in the past couple months, they just finished it up. It's new build, it has a gorgeous, giant, master, bathroom. Ooh, let's go look. And Which side the master? This way. Yay. The closet is huge. Like you're going to need a step ladder or <laughs> one of those like hook things that they have at the stores. Okay. So here's master. Oh, it's beautiful. Love. So much storage. Yeah. I love the built-in. That's awesome. And then here's the closet and it goes, they have racks all the way up to the ceiling. <laughs> Yeah. Oh. So that's awesome for like winter storage or I, we have a couple of those. My last house had like the pull downs. Oh, nice. Yeah. And so my current one doesn't, but this is great. You can get one of those like poles from yes. um, Amazon. And a Whirlpool tub. Yeah. It's like big enough for two. That's huge. Yeah. 
Love it, love it. Okay, so it's three bed? Yes, three bedroom, two bath. We've got um, split floor plan? Yes, split floor plan and open floor plan. Love. And then here's the utility room okay. with some more storage. Cute, very cute. And then there's even a built-in in the office. This home has built-ins everywhere and I love it. This is an adorable, beautiful, beautiful home. Yes. They did a great job. Do we know yeah. the builder? Do we know yes, the name? It is Liberty, Liberty Homes. Liberty Homes. And then the other bedroom, and then they have lights in the closets, which usually you don't find. No, oh, and I like this, this is gorgeous. It's all very neutral. Love neutral. Blank slate to start your own design, or your love own style. Love neutral. Well, I love that you got to do this open house today. I know, me too, I did it yesterday as well. All the fans. Mm -hmm have these little scroller things for the speed built in. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, that's awesome. Oh, so like that, that way you don't have to yeah. mess with pulling the chain. Yeah. And then the closet as a line. Love it. I love new construction. Me it's too. My jam. Right? It's my jam. They did a great job. Okay, so you've had one person so far? Yeah, one we've had um, one person today, and then yesterday we had three, and a lender actually came by and introduced himself, and he gave me Who was it? a book. Um, I'm gonna have to look up his name. That's always awesome. I don't remember. Do you see this little tab right there, that ah, little square? Yes. So somebody said you can like take your, oh. yes, and you just like, it's because they're uh, spray foam. Their insulation is right there. And you pull it out. I might have to get my screwdriver, but you pop it out a little bit and then it'll catch. Oh. I don't know if I moved it a little bit. Let's see. Nice. I don't know if that worked, <laughs> but I was like, okay, so isn't that cool? It's so like even on like your interior doors. That's awesome. Yeah. It's good to know. Tell me a little bit about real estate. You've been in it for seven years. Yes, I've been in it for seven years. Um, learn something new every day. Every day. Um, I worked whenever I first started, I was in the Tulsa area. Mm -hmm. And I moved here over a year ago. Mm -hmm. And whenever I was in Tulsa, I worked with a developer. And that was like my favorite I thing. I love working with developers. Yes. Yeah. It was new like, construction, yes. development, all the things. Yes, it was so fun. Um, I learned so much. I helped them get all their like plans accepted and I got to watch every step of the way That's of good them to know. developing the land. Yeah. Because a lot of agents like they'll sell new construction, but they have absolutely like no idea of how the new construction works. So yes. you've got like the insight on like if mini blinds come or storm shelters or fences. Okay, from Oklahoma, like Tulsa to Norman, can you tell a difference in the market? Yes. Yeah. Um, this are this area here because I still do homes and stuff in Tulsa. Right. Not as often anymore. Yeah. And it, like comparing the two different markets in Tulsa, everything seems to be a little bit more cheaper. Um, really? Here. Yes. I wonder why. I, I don't. College know. town? That's because we're of, college town, maybe. That's what I was thinking as well. Um, and then it seems that we have less available, like we than we do in the Tulsa area. I could see that. Um, but I. It's, it's been all great. That's really interesting. Like, I love Tulsa. I would move to Tulsa. Yeah. Um, I love Norman, but I've been here for so long. And so I've always heard that, like, Norman is its own little bubble with real estate. It really is. And it's, like, hard to get into. And, yeah, it took me, like, 10 years to break that bubble to finally, like, get established. Mm -hmm. Man. I'm so excited that you're on my team, though. Me too. I'm so excited to be here. Fresh faces, fresh area. Yes. That helps. Yes. Knowledge of new construction. If you would have to say, what's your favorite thing? Would you say new construction's your favorite to sell or first time home buyers or? See, that's what, I love helping first time home buyers because mm -hmm. homes are so important. Like it's a necessity that everyone has to have. You have to have a roof over your heads, yes. And since they don't know anything, there's just so much more I feel like I can help them with and help them get the foot in the door and teach them about all the different yes. things that there is. And that's one thing that I just love to do is because whenever I, I first bought my house, I had no idea what was going on, no idea what to look for. Like my budget was lower than low and I was just trying to get out. Like I, was, yeah. I wasn't in the best living situation and where I was wasn't the safest. And I was ready to have like my own place and to be in a safe space and have something my own. I love first time home buyers too. Yeah. Cause it's like, 
they like, it's kind of that situation sometimes where they like need that help so mm -hmm. they don't question everything. They yeah. like, they trust you. Yeah. Whereas like, people who kind of come back around or they have like their dad's specters or like it's like hard whenever it's but when they're like I'm a first time home buyer I, I want to use you I follow your lead I trust everything you have to do I'm like this yes yes make it happen has been brought to you by Cardinal Financial creating a better mortgage experience